I had a request for man color. Not quite sure what that is. And didn't get clarification except from another friend who is also a crafter. And she said bold colors. And I'd say these were pretty bold. As in standing out seeing me, I'm so bold. And just in case I was right and it was a couple of colors cuz I'm a man yeah here we have three colors likely end up with a few more because of the blending but it's the nature of tie-dye and green yellow which is turned out to be lime and blue pretty much be a man color and here we have one that's been tied with jute because it's supposed to create all those shapes again and you can tell it was pretty saturated because look at all the dye in the in the pan yeah and then that's good for is recycling for black needs a little yellow thrown in there and it'll create black but don't know if we're gonna do that it's gonna be fun to unwrap and when you make them sit for a while which is curing or batching depending upon which person you listen to you wrap them all up like this this one is only two colors we all know it's got black on it too for overdub, but you can't see that, can you? No, you cannot. And here I was dying this one. I thought, okay, we'll go with navy and green and purple. Then I thought, hmm, that green and purple might make brown in some spots because of the red and the purple. But it doesn't appear to have done so so far again y'all look how much dye is in that pan well and here it is where you can see it clearer and you'll see the colors have stayed pretty true but those rubber bands are pretty tight you couldn't tell from the tension in the fabric I can show you my fingers where there's a blister from one of them. These are tied in Mandela's, which I have not made work yet. But I think we might get lucky this time. Mandela's a lot easier to tie into a scarf than it is to tie this way. I do have some scarves and bandanas that I'm going to dye they're going to be so much quicker than these shirts because they're not going to just keep replying and having to re reapply and reapply so cross your fingers and hope we get a mandela because if not you know i'm going to try again i don't let many things best me i don't plan on this being one of them y'all have a great day Thank you for watching my video, hit like, go to my YouTube page and hit like and subscribe on that, I appreciate it if you do, and my YouTube page will come up if you put did she meet the challenge, it'll come up, it'll be the first one, and I've checked it on it's about six different people's things, where of I speak. Alright, so those are some man colored ones. There are a few more, but I think I'm gonna let those be a surprise. Those folds were very intricate, so we're crossing our fingers and hoping on those. 
Thank you for watching my video. If you like me doing videos, hit like. If you like the video because I'm a crazy nut, hit like. If you like the video because you like tie-dye, hit like. Uh, this video is also going to be on my YouTube page, which is Carla Maxwell with K. But you can find it easily if you put, did she meet the challenge? It'll kick right up. That's that first video. And y'all have a great day. And I appreciate you watching and stopping by. Stay tuned. I'll show you tomorrow what these look like. And we'll debate if we got man colors. Man colors.